I salute you. There is no day I don't receive insults from my parents mm -hmm. as a result of my poor performance in school. This is the bearer of the most intelligent student in my school. Mm -hmm. In my hand is your bearer. As just change your brain with men, you will be dull and even more dull than me. You will read and you will never understand. <laughs> Bella! <laughs> Bella! <laughs> Bella! Bella! <laughs> <laughs> Great Kakuna, I greet you. Take a good look at you. Am I not <laughs> my stepsister is getting married. Before over my dead body, it will not happen. With this, this is her cloth. From today, I want rashes to be upon her. <laughs> Documents of the young man that left me and married another girl. Hmm. From today henceforth, he will lose his job mm. 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 and feed from hand to mouth. Mm. 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 Great Kaku, as you all know. I'm an influential businessman in this society. But for the past few months, I've been experiencing loss in my business. Mm. And this is not good. I lost all my customers. And I want to get them back with great capital. I cannot post of two million in my account anymore. I want to get back all my customers. Great Kakuna. <laughs> Take this perfume. And in the morning, go to your shop. Spray this perfume in front of your shop. Thanks of those people who send the same product to you. Seven good times. I repeat, seven good times. Oh, my God. Rub it on your face whenever you are going out. Rub it on your face whenever you are going out. Rub it. See you and cherish you. I greet you. I'm not happy. My younger sister's daughter came from Spain. And all she could give me is this shoe. What insult! With this shoe in my hand, you will never step your feet out of this country again. <laughs> you and your mother 
Father, we from this day feed from hand to mouth. Eat up! Eat up! Eat up! Eat up! Great Kakuna, I greet you. With me is the part of my brother's wife. Mm. Ever since my brother got married to his so-called wife, he has stopped giving me money. Mm. 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 And her prayer affects me every night. Mm. 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 With this your pants in my hands, you will never get pregnant. Caro! 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 Kakuna! Great Kakuna! Great Kakuna! One of the youngest in the National House of Assembly. <laughs> and as a senator, I have been nicknamed the philanthropist. Mm -hmm. <laughs> because I give money to everybody in my constituency. <laughs> but they don't know that with the money I give them, I steal their destiny. <laughs> <laughs> so I have come, I have come to ask the great Kakuna. With this little token, more of this money. As I drop more of this money, I want more money. Mm. More money. Mm. So I'll have so much to give to many people mm. and still be destiny. <laughs> <laughs> Mama Karo, devoted. Mm. 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 Fast about it. Mm. Mm. Fast. I think you can bring shit. Don't forget our major task this year, which is to kill, to steal, and to destroy.
example, God created this world by the spoken word of his mouth. Isaac also decreed upon the life of his son, Jacob, and the world molded the life of Jacob. Jacob also called the children in Genesis chapter 49, Reuben, thou art my firstborn, you are my might, the beginning of my strength, the dignity I have. And he said, Unstable as water thou shalt not accept. That was the beginning of the trouble of Reuben. He took the anointing of Moses to say, Let who believe and not die, let his men not be few. Because definitely people have been speaking against tongues from the negative altar. I stand on this altar of God to alter every negative statement that men and women has altered against your life and I reverse it in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Your businesses, your career, your profession, where men have spoken decoded language that are unexplainable and that is negatively affecting your life today. I stand as a priest, I stand as a prophet of God, I stand as the oracle of heaven. That statement made on a negative altar is reversed in your life today in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree, I don't know who has taken your garment of wedding to an evil altar. I don't know who has taken your wedding suit to an evil altar to delay the manifestation of your marriage. I don't know who has shot their womb and taken your baby to an evil altar and they shut it off for you not to have that child. I don't know any man or any woman that have taken your certificate. You graduated out of the university, out of higher institution. You are roaming in the street and you can't get a job. You are safe. You have not gone anywhere. You are moving from pillar to post, walking like an elephant and eating like an ant. I come to declare that as the man peace of heaven, I reverse every negative thing they have done about your life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I will have just watched something. Every satanic pot that the enemy has taken your garment into, they've taken your certificate and they shot it in that pot. They took your certificate, they put it in that pot. They took your garment, they put it there. They took your career, your style they lock it in an evil pot so that you cannot see your heavenly life. I stand on this altar of God. They place that pot in an altar or they bury it on the ground because they place it on the altar or they stood on the altar to decree it. I live on this altar of God. Altar versus altar. When two powers meet, the Lord must bow. Greater is he that is in me than that which is in the world. I stand as a priest of heaven on this altar of God. I altar what is put in the negative altar against you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I command that altar to be broken. That altar that is speaking a voice against you, that altar that is entering the negative things against your destiny, I stand on this altar and reverse it in the name of Jesus Christ. I stand on the higher anointing of Jehovah and I speak to your destiny. That evil altar shall no longer speak against you. You remember Gideon? Gideon was moving from place to places. He could not make a head with a life. But the Lord spoke to Gideon. The altars in your father's house is what is speaking against you. Take a lamb, kill it and offer it on that altar. Then the voice of that altar will be silent. And he took the second one. He offered it on the new altar. And I stand on this new altar of God. Every negative altar that received blood and sacrifices to alter your destiny against what God has said concerning you. I stand on this altar. I reverse it in the name of Jesus Christ. Every altar that is not of God, speaking against your marriage, speaking against your finance, speaking against your future, speaking against your education, speaking against anything that God has promised you in life. I stand on this altar. I reverse it in the name of Jesus Christ. You will prosper in wherever you go. From today, go forth and do exploit in the kingdom. In Jesus' name, amen.